Our destination this time is Letchworth State Park. The picturesque road is heading us to New York State. It is located in about three hours drive from Toronto. But hold on, let me share what is in between these destinations. There is a duty-free shopping, a custom and a border which we successfully passed. We have arrived to Canada's southern neighbor. The indoor touristic centers along the highways are there to rest. By the evening, our powerful Mini Cooper brought us to the hotel. Have a look what to expect in it, just in case you stay overnight or two, like us there. We really liked the facility. However, the service provided in the breakfast area was poor. Sorry to mention, but we could barely find a clean spot for two of us. The tenants had to continuously bother the staff for coffee or a bag of tea. Thus, we decided to get it next time, as we need to go to the attraction. Needless to say that this is a patriotic country. Turn right. There are a lot of American flags have been displaced at the homes of the local community county. Continue 18 kilometers. The great thing about the attraction we are aiming to visit now is that it has almost 5 stars review. We finally have arrived to Letchworth State Park. We left our car behind to enjoy the park using our hardy legs. Known as the Grand Canyon of the East, the park compresses more than 14 acres of scenic magnificence along the mighty Genius River. We are facing Upper Falls now with the bridge and this picture shows us how the bridge looked in 1852.
the steep Genese Gorge walls, the river winding below, the plunge and spray of dramatic waterfalls, and the lush forests all contribute to make the park one of the most notable examples of waterfall and gorge scenery in the eastern United States. This Mother Nature Lover's Paradise is full of hiking and bike trails, picnic areas, inspiration points, trailside lodge, falls and people. Now we came to Middle Falls. This park is an important place for people to connect with history and nature. You can explore magnificent landscape and historical homes. Lechworth State Park exists today due to the generosity of one man, William Breer Letchworth. Mr. Letchworth was a businessman from Buffalo, New York. But more importantly, he was a visionary, leader, benefactor, social reformer and committed Quaker. The customers of this restaurant are welcome to vote for being cat people or dog people. Who do you think you are? Now we see a lower Fallstone Arch Bridge, which was a popular tourist destination in 1870s. Here at the Flume, Denise River was less than 10 feet wide.
Letchworth ranks in the top 10 for all state parks for having the most rare species populations. Our journey of discovery goes to Rochester to see what it is interesting there which might catch our attention. And here you go! If you are interested in visiting a historical place in Rochester, uh, Warner Castle is a site to consider. Self-guided tours of an 18 54 residents modeled after a Scottish castle along with a sunken garden. This is a gorgeous place for taking individual or family photographs here on the ground. Special credits to my husband Alex for organizing this trip.